I was almost not willing to try. You know, I just said, you know what? I can't take a college boy coming over here with a baseball cap and a pair of tennis shoes telling me what I've done here all my life to move cattle here and do this and that. I said, I don't know if I can, I can do that. And I grew up in an area where holistic ranch management came in and when they got to the end, they had no grass to go. So it left a very uh, sorry taste in their mouths. There's still people around said, you're crazy, it never works. Not that many ranchers in our area have done this, but it seemed worth a try. And it was an experiment to begin with. But what we heard and what we have seen have been absolutely remarkable benefits for us. I almost didn't want to admit that I was seeing the difference, but then I began to realize that the condition of the cattle were changing. Flies, uh, the 22-day cycle was breaking. And my medicine bill is probably 10% of what an average ranch would be. So I don't know if we could have done anything better. When you got grass belly high, cattle don't have to work too hard to get it, you know? Within three years of changing to this new practice, we found an incredible difference in our grasslands. We went from three or four basic types of grasses. And now we have counted over 45, which is pretty amazing to imagine that that seed bank was here. Look at all the western wheat coming under, the, under that tree. This right here is a cool season grass called western wheat grass, and you can see a lot more abundance here. If we had continuous grazing, we would not have that. Actually, People said there were no cool season grasses in this part of the world. We didn't have any for 30 years until we started rotational grazing. And then with the opportunity, if they're not bitten off regularly and repeatedly, they have a chance to grow, and here they are. Because of the presence of cool season grasses, we're not nearly as dependent on the supplement. Before we went on a rotational grazing program, our feed bill was about $60,000 a year, and it's dropped down two-thirds from that. 